What's up CFI? Tuesday's workout of the day is four rounds per time, 75 double unders, 25 alternating dumbbell snatches, 15 push-ups. This is a workout where each round we're expecting to take somewhere around two to three minutes. So make sure that you're scaling your work to try and hit that window. So if we're looking at each movement and how we want to scale them, double unders first, that's about a minute of work, give or take a handful of seconds. So if you've got the double under skill, but 75 is gonna take you all day, make sure you scale the reps down. That could be 50 reps, that could be 30 reps, or it could mean that you just practice the double unders for a minute and then move on to the next movement. Alternating dumbbell snatches, pick a weight that can, you can just keep moving for the entire set of 25 without having to rest, all right? I know you're limited with equipment, so maybe you just use the dumbbell or the kettlebell that you have, that's gonna be okay. Push-ups. We're looking for at least our first set to be unbroken, maybe even our first couple sets. So you can scale a couple different ways. You can scale the volume if need be, so you can bring it down to 10 push-ups instead of 15, or we can scale the range of motion itself by doing a knee variation push-up or bringing our hands up on a box or a table or bench to elevate that hand position just a little bit, okay? So this is a workout that we can push. So get after this one, have a little fun with it. After we finish that today, we've got a core finisher. It's gonna to be Tabata style. So 20, 20 seconds of work, followed by 10 seconds of rest. We're gonna alternate between two movements, which is gonna be the hollow body hold and the Superman hold. So each of these movements, you're gonna to get to do for six intervals, but you're gonna alternate intervals each time. So every 20 seconds of work, you're doing a different movement. All right, have fun with this one guys and have a great Tuesday.